Well, here's the uh, the rest of it, the frame, the engine. Typical Land Cruiser stuff. Uh, parts of it, though, are pretty darn nice. I mean, there are parts of this frame which are really bizarre in that you can see some shiny stuff there and then very, very smooth. Uh, very short distance away you have some scaly rust. We can see that somebody has affixed a, a fairly custom bumper to the back of this, of which we're going to eliminate that. It may cause us, it looks like, to eliminate the rear, rear cross member because it's a full weld right across. And that's going to be a real problem. I'm going to suggest that we uh, get rid of this cross member and just put in a brand new cross member. Uh, we may be able to retain the leaf spring gusset and the frame gusset, let's hope. These, those might come up with a fight. They're not too bad, but we'll, we'll address those. Now you can see the rest of it here. It has dual exhaust, Chevy 350 typical, and uh, automatic transmission. That's probably a 700R or a 350 turbo, something, something like that. Either way, um, it's in there and we'll pull it out so we can sandblast the frame.